thought I would end up here. Ever. There's no way. Early 90s, I ran the most successful illegal sex business of all times. I had hundreds of girls working for me. I lived in a $5 million house in Beverly Hills. I bought from the actor Michael Douglas. Even though I was arrested 20 years ago, I'm known as the Hollywood Madam. What I did, some people say it's illegal. The courts found it illegal, and I went to jail for that. A hardcore women's penitentiary for over three years. Other madams get arrested, and they always say, oh, bigger than Heidi Fleiss, better than Heidi Fleiss, but you don't know one of those other madams' names. And look it, if you're gonna run an illegal business, why are you gonna live in some little apartment? You'll never see another man of ever living how I did. I moved to Nevada to open up a brothel with a twist, have men be the hookers instead of women. And I was living in the Caesars Palace, and after two months, it got kind of crazy. So I decided to rent a home a half hour away from where Charles Manson was captured. And right next door to me was this little trailer. I didn't know who was in it but there was a bedridden former madam who once ran the exotic bird department for the Tropicana Hotel in Vegas, when Vegas was real Vegas. This madam on her deathbed said to me, Heidi, you take care of my birds. And I told her no, and she dropped dead. Uh, at that moment, everything changed because uh, I fell in love with these birds, and um, who knows, everything happens for a reason. Who am I? I don't know. Some people say I'm a washed up whore. Some people say I'm a crackhead. Some people like me, some people hate me, or some people known as a crazy lady who plays with birds. It's been a crazy way to reinvent myself, but I love my birds and I will be successful no matter what I do. Uh -huh.